So, digital pinhole, what is that? Well, it's uh, what I've done here is I've essentially uh, made two boxes that fit together. There's a plate on the front. I've got multiple plates that I can change the aperture and try uh, some different stuff, ranging from slit to pinhole. But inside the box, two boxes really, right in the middle at about nine inches is a piece of diffusion gel, which uh, essentially it's a camera obscura projection landing on the gel, and then I'm photographing the result. And it still requires a very long exposure, so you get some of the artifacts along with the vignetting and the other crazy wonderful artifacts of pinhole. So on the lathe I took a, a piece of brazing rod, I think it is, it's brass rod maybe, and uh, just carved it down to that just by eye. So we'll see what this aperture ends up looking like when I drill a hole through the uh, soda pop can, aluminum. So I've been experimenting uh, with creating different types of pins instead of drill bits on the lathe. Uh, this one is actually carved out of a finish nail. And uh, what I'd like to do is insert that into a dowel that has a disc of emery cloth so that uh, when the hole gets uh, burned, punched, drilled, um, it would also burnish or polish the rim of it as part of that same process. And two other things, a uh, photo every 31 seconds since the exposures were sometimes as long as 30. And then having a rangefinder was pretty helpful.